Hi, class. Welcome to Vegan 101 taught by dherbs.com. Please remember to hit the subscribe button for notifications on all future content. In a world full of processed foods, added sugars, trans fats, chemical additives, and GMOs, it can be hard to know what you're eating is vegan or not. There are actually a lot of foods that people think are vegan, but actually have animal products in them. We don't want you to be in the dark about these secretly non-vegan foods, so we did some digging and found some pretty surprising results. We hope this helps you in your quest to keep eating a healthy vegan diet. Today, we're going to be covering different foods that you think are vegan, but are not. Let's dive into the lesson. Frozen french fries. It's hard to believe that these aren't just potatoes. Some, not all, frozen french fries are cooked in animal fat before they are frozen. Make sure you read the label to find out if they were. It will be beneficial to cut these out of your diet because they are loaded with chemical additives and processed ingredients. Worcestershire sauce. This classic sauce is notoriously made with anchovies to achieve its flavor. There are, however, brands that don't use anchovies, which makes it vegan friendly. Chips. While this isn't true for all chips, a lot of chips are made with pork enzymes. If you glance over the ingredients, you might miss porcine enzymes. Be on the lookout for this ingredient, especially in brands like Doritos, Fritos, and Lay's. White sugar. First off, stevia and agave syrup are way healthier options than regular sugar. Refined sugar is not naturally white, rather bone char, which is often labeled as natural carbon, which is used to give sugar the white color. Honey. Veganism means that you don't consume anything that is a product of the animal kingdom. Since honey is a product of bees, it is technically not vegan, although some choose to overlook that. Breath mints. Altoid uses gelatin in the production of its mints. Ingredients may not be the first thing you look at when you buy breath mints, but companies can use animal products in many things. Altoid does make a vegan-friendly breath mint called Sugar-Free Smalls. It probably isn't the only brand that uses gelatin, so be on the lookout. Pad Thai. If you order pad thai at a restaurant, it's probably made with fish sauce because that is the classic ingredient in the dish. If you make pad thai at home, you can easily omit the fish sauce without compromising the flavor. That's a pretty surprising list, right? In addition to the above foods, marshmallows, jello, obviously, some bagels and bread, dark beer, Caesar dressing, and French onion soup all have animal products in them. Make sure you double check for animal products when you're buying food. That's all for today, students. Tune in next week for another lesson of Vegan 101, powered by dherbs.com.